Hey, hello, hi everyone. Paul Laker here reporting in Pu'unene near the Maui Humane Society where firefighters continue to work on that fire behind me. Uh, this is a brush fire that consumed at least 35 acres, but more notably than that is that it closed the Maui Veterans Highway for quite some time. The fire broke out around two o'clock this afternoon. By uh, close to three o'clock or so, they had the highway closed all the way from Hanson Road to uh, North Kihei Road. Uh, Maui veterans closed that entire stretch. So as you can imagine, a lot of confused tourists and other travelers on the road there trying to figure out what is going on here. Not only that, but it backed up the alternate routes. People tried to take the highway near Ma'alaya to get in the backside into Kihei, and that was backed up for hours. Uh, firefighters say again this was a 35 acre fire. They don't know the cause of it. Had it about 70% contained around 5 o'clock this evening. Beyond that, uh, no, like I said, no cause of the fire, but they do know those strong winds. They say 20 to 25 miles an hour are what pushed the fire uh, to consume that very dry vegetation that's out here. And I will tell you, this is not the first time that Maui Alert has been out into this general area to report to you what's going on with brush fires. And it really begs the question, what is being done to get these fuels under control in light of the Lahaina fire that of course killed at least 99 people and consumed more than 2,000 homes out there. Questions we have to be asking at this point, what can we do to get these fire issues under control so we don't have road closures, so we don't have to worry about at least the threat of fires consuming buildings and putting people's lives at risk, in this case, animals' lives at risk. Uh, this fire, not that close to the Humane Society in terms of feet, just the general area out here, but uh, a few months ago, I was at a fire that was close to the Maui Humane Society. We reported that on Maui Alert, uh, just across the street, essentially. So these fire issues, I guess, is the bottom line, persist. And we need to be asking ourselves, undoubtedly, what are we going to do to get the upper hand on this? What are our county leaders, our fire department officials, what are they going to suggest that we do to get our hands on this? Because clearly, it is an issue that is not going away, that does need to be addressed. Well, that's it for now, everybody. Here at the site of the latest brush fire in Pu'unene, I'm Paul Aker, Maui Alert News, your source for the best journalism and live video daily broadcasts on Maui Alert and MauiAlert.com. Aloha, everyone.